Hey guys, this is Srikant Rathod here. Today I came up with the another topic called last digit of a product. So this concepts really gonna help you to the competitive exams, which doesn't allow you to use a calculator. So and how do you find the last digit of a product for the any number which are multiple? This is I'm gonna show you, and you can solve it within a fractions of second, right? Okay, right. So to find a last digit of a product let's better take an example so if i have a number something 8924 times 3456 times i can say 433 times 517 times let's take 4403 now question is if you multiply all this number what would be the last digit of this result so to find the last digit what i need to do is just take the last digit of every number here so that is the last digit here is 4 last digit of this one it's going to be 6 then multiply them 4 times 6 same way follow the last make a first make in a pair and take the last digits of every number here i can say 3 times 7 and here there are no other numbers allowed to make a pair take it as it is right so now what we get 4 times 6 is going to be 24 and 3 times 7 it's going to be 21 again i follow the same result take the last digit of this result and the last digit of this it becomes what do you get 4 times 1 so you are getting the result this as 4 and multiply this 4 with the 3 which carry forwarded here right so we can do 4 times 3 the result it's going to be 12 so the last digit of this entire product is 2 right this is how you solve it's a simple whenever question asking you to find the last digit just keep repeating this term till you get the last number okay till you get the end result right let's take another example let's take 294 times 323 times 481 times 379 now what is the last digit of this product so follow the same rule take the last number last number here and make a pair like this so we can do it like 4 times 3 it's going to be 12 and take the last digits here 1 times 9 it's going to be right so 1 times 9 the result it's going to be 9 itself take the last digit of this number and this is al already a single digit so just multiply them so i can say 2 times 9 in this case the result it's going to be 18 and the last digit of the multiplication of all this number is 18 so what does it mean when you are multiplying this number so we are getting a very huge number i don't know what these are but my last digit it's going to be 8 so my last digit always it's going to be 8 not 18 okay so last digit it's going to be 8 whereas we are looking for the last digit of a number so this is how you can call sometimes you may also get a question saying that what would be the last two digits of a product instead of asking you a uh, one they may ask you la last two digits so let's take this type as well let's take an example if i have a number 7845 times 9512 times 408 times 613 now if they are asking you what would be the last two digit of this product then in this case you have to as we are talking about the two digits so you have to take the last two digits and you have to multiply with each other like the same way what we did for the last one because they were asking for last one digit and now they are asking like what would be the last two digit of this product so i have to take the last two numbers and multiply so it's what we do here this is take it so i'll be doing here as 45 times 12 okay and here i'll be taking this last two numbers this is going to be 08 times 13 right now when you multiply 45 times 12 what it's going to be your result 45 times 10 it's going to be 
and 45 times 2 it's gonna be 90 uh, 450 plus 90 it's gonna be 540 this is how we can do a calculation faster i just splitted you know the 12 in terms of 10 plus 2 so because easier to do any multiplication with the 10 is this so easy so that's why i split the 12 into 10 plus 2 and then i multiplied 45 times 10 it's gonna be 450 2 is left 45 times 2 it's gonna be 90 so 450 plus 90 gives me 540 this is how i do now 8 times 10 it's gonna be 80 plus 3 has been left 8 times 3 is gonna be 24 80 plus 24 what we're gonna get here 104 right this is how we do the multiplication next once we're done with this again i have to take the last two digits 40 and 04 and multiply them 40 times 04 or just i can read it as 4 itself 40 times uh, you know 4 so it's gonna be 160 or 4 times 4 it's gonna be 16 and this 0 i can add it here 160 so the last two digit of this entire product is 160 sorry 60 60 so the result is ending here with something but the last two digit it's gonna be 60 this is how it will be right let's take another example right okay i have an another example here 8 9 2 5 times 5 4 3 1 times 785 let's take so in this case the last what would be the last two digit of this number so take last two digit here and last two digit here and multiply them so 25 times 31 so what the result you're gonna get so 25 times 31 if you multiply you'll be getting it as 775 okay and that result you have to multiply with this 85 as there is no one uh, no other numbers allowed you know uh, available to make a pair so you have to multiply now take last two digit of this one and the multiply here with 85 so what i do here 75 times 85 75 times 85 let's do it manually 85 times 75 if you multiply 5 times 5 it's gonna be 25 carry 2 forwarded 5 times it's gonna be 40 40 plus 2 it's gonna be 42 plus 7 times 5 is gonna be 35 so carry 5 sorry 5 and carry forwarded as 3 uh, 7 times 8 56 and what we're gonna get here 56 plus 3 is gonna be 59 so when you add it it's gonna be uh, 5 5 7 it's gonna be what it's 9 plus 4 is gonna be 13 and this is 6 6 3 7 5 the product of this number is gonna be 6 3 7 5 and they are asking us what would be the last digit sorry last two digits so last two digit of this entire product it's gonna be 75 not 63 6 3 7 5 okay so when you multiply this you'll be getting other number along with the last two digit as 75 and so on if they are asking you what is the product of last three digits so you have to take the three numbers and you have to keep multiplying so this is the way all right so that's it for tomorrow today thank you so much for watching